There's some spot flooding going on where we are, and this is the kind of thing crews here in Santa Rosa are trying to stay on top of. It was all hands on deck on Shillingford Place. Every transportation and public works crew assigned in Santa Rosa tonight built a temporary bypass to divert water away from the burned homes on the street. Since we got a little bit of running here, what we want to do is we want to avoid any water going over the sidewalk and possibly going into the burned homes um, that create erosion and whatnot. And we're trying to avoid that. Many of Fountain Grove's plastic storm pipes melted in the fires last month. Work has begun to replace them with metal pipe, but not in time for this latest storm, which is why crews are staffed 24 7 until the rain is over. They're going from block to block, checking potential trouble spots. Water was starting to pond in a couple of areas, but I was there to clear the drain and get everything flowing. They're also inspecting the hillsides and the areas along the creek. There's concern that the fire ravaged terrain may be more prone to landslides. Residents have been warned to be extra vigilant and have a plan to leave just in case. The people living in there in the houses, we don't want anything to, any of them to get evacuated or take off on the banks there. So. Santa Rosa officials got a briefing from the National Weather Service, and they were told the next several hours are what they need to keep their eye on, especially the hours between midnight and 3 a.m. Live in Santa Rosa, Lillian Kim, ABC 7 News.